Oh, oh no. I looked and then I was running. Oh, she's just sitting over there. She's taunting us! There's no way forward. There is no. Did you race the ones before too? That's how we know she likes you. Aww. I did. I wanted to see how you would handle Malikos. You were testing me? And you passed. Congratulations. Are you gonna help me with this? I'm sure you can handle it. Ah! What are these? Are these ash? Sorry, I messed up your ash people. Mark, how are you? How was your Friday? This woman you travel with. Who is she? See her? Wait, how do you know about her? I have seen your companions. Marikos wanted me to attack them, but they posed no threat. See her, um... Well, she used to be a Jedi. It's a long story. I would like to learn it. I'll meet you at your ship. Okay, bye! I keep pressing the wrong button to meditate. But it's been pretty slow. Oh, nice! Congratulations! So no more night sisters or night brothers are going to going to attack us. I hope maybe Oh yeah, where he just kept salting his food at that cutscene. Yeah, that was that was really silly. Hey, 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 we have a deal. This was the one that was, uh... Ah! We're safe. Hi, we have a new crew member. Please don't be upset. You found it. Oh, well, who's this? What's that supposed to mean? It means I'll be joining you. Seer, Grease, this is Marin. She's a witch, isn't she? A night sister. Your fear is unnecessary. I couldn't have gotten the Astrium without her. We fought Malikos together. <laughs> I trust her. And we trust you. You will have to earn it. Be fine. <laughs> Grab some seat. Or you can try anything funny. Welcome aboard. They like you. 
<laughs> I like how she's like, uh, okay. Aww. I don't know what you're saying. Oh, he's so sad. Aw, BD. I love how emotive they've made BD with just a few few noises and some antennas. It's really adorable. She doesn't speak binary. I think we got some new lightsaber parts. Let's see. Uh, peace and justice. This just looks like a candlestick. Oh, we got his, uh, his, uh, his hilt. I kind of like this one. I'm gonna put it on there. Did we find any new ones? We have a blue one. I think we've had this one. I feel like the the gold is just way too gaudy. This game shall be mine. I hope you enjoy it though, Yale. I'm sorry about um, the unemployment. Sometimes but... the exhaust valve needs a bit of tending to, but otherwise, it hasn't been much of an issue. Cal, care to join me? Sure. Grease has gone outside for once. What? Figured I'd take the time to rest. Not a bad idea. You two have spent a lot of time together. I think it's Marin's turn to enjoy his charm. <laughs> think she can handle it? He's superstitious enough to give her space, relatively speaking. Makes me want to learn magic. <laughs> Seriously. Sometimes the exhaust valve needs a bit of tending to, but otherwise, it hasn't been much of an issue. <laughs> He's right there! What are you thinking about? How quiet it is. I don't know if it's because Grease is off the ship or <laughs> He's right there! Else. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I'm not sure. I don't know if I like it. Silence is strange when you aren't looking for it. Almost makes me want to fill these walls with music from my Halleck set or something. Yeah, we should start playing again. Maybe. I don't often feel up to it these days. I've always wanted to learn an instrument. Think you could teach me? After this is all settled? I'd like that. Yeah. Can I talk to you? No, she's just gonna sit there? Okay. I could use some time to my own thoughts. All righty. Uh, let's see. I don't know how far. Let's get out there. How far away we are from, from the end. But I think we're just gonna. We're just gonna go. We're gonna do this it. Cordova guy is really putting some wear and tear on my ship. We always wanted to explore the whole galaxy. And did you? We explored many planets, tombs and temples related to the Zepho and Jedi. But I hit a limit. To him, there was no limit. The poor crazy old guy was left alone. He was always alone, even when I was with him. He cared about his work and the future more than anything else. He didn't have the time. He was always on the move. Magana was the first place I ever saw that looked like he settled, even for a brief moment. Sit down, kid. It's time to land. Not too far from the end. Okay. It worked for Cordova. You can make it work. She's right. 
Oh, hey, is anybody hungry? I, I was thinking of whipping up some scat steaks. I'm sorry, am I interrupting? No, Captain. And we couldn't have gotten this far without you. Oh, <laughs> well, uh, it's true, Grease. Thank you. Hey, I hope you get in there and you find that hollow thing. Holocron. Are you sure it's something you should find? What do you mean? The children on that list. If you take them from their homes to train as Jedi, won't they be hunted like you? It has to be kept out of the hands of the Empire. It'll help us put an end to the Empire. Oh, hey, uh, change of plans. We're arriving. Oh, Grease. I take my steak rare. Huh. Huh? Okay. Now we're cooking. Hey, Abby. You're about to get that hollow cron. Nice. You remembered. You joining me? Oh, no, no, absolutely not. No, I just wanted to say, you know, those those kids we're supposed to find. They're lucky to have you. They're lucky to have us. We're in this together, Grease. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't hoping you'd say that, because, you know, they're gonna need more than fancy magic tricks. Oh, uh, yeah? Practical guidance, role model, someone to look up to. You know, ship flying's a complicated art. But that's only if I stick around. I remember that. Good. Good. Okay. Good luck, buddy. Thanks. <laughs> and there's something weird about this place. The energy is different here. Yeah, it's different than Dathomir. Yes. Dathomir is intricate. Its ancient power emanates from the shadows. Bagano feels more simplistic, and yet... I can't figure it out. Uh, Bagano is special. There's a reason the Zeppo built their vault here. Where your holocron waits. Hidden. What are you getting at? This planet has remained nearly untouched for centuries. Were the lives you seek to protect really in danger before you intervened? She makes a lot of sense. But why would we end the game right now? The Jedi retrain will help build a galaxy that respects and preserves special places like this one. And that is their choice or yours? We need each other to survive. Without the Jedi, I don't know if we can. We have a responsibility to protect them. So you've said. Cal, got a second? Sure. You've been through a lot to get here. But the vault is still an unknown. Cordova put the holocron inside. That's what's important. I have to get it. Cordova built danger into this test to protect it. You're worried about me. I don't want to train all those young things alone. Huh. I'll be fine, Seer. I Plus, do. I've got BD with me. I know. Just be careful. This might be unlike anything you two have faced before. Thanks. We're ready. We're I do really hope that they give them the choice, though. Take care of each other. Hold it. Like, I know it's hard to not want to give them the, the choice, because they might be taken by the Empire. But forcing anyone to do anything just sounds like the worst idea. Okay, I need to get up and grab some more water. Hi, Scary Crazy Better Knife. Uh, I'm gonna get up grab some water. And then we'll uh, finish this up. Uh, it's also extremely warm in here. I think I turned the heater up too high, so I'm gonna go turn that down. Uh, make sure you guys get up, walk around. I'll see you guys in a moment. BRB. Welcome back, everybody. Uh, cool.
threw the presents on the fire. Doesn't wrapping paper get, like, toxic? If, uh, thrown in the fire or something? Yeah, I just took my hoodie off. It was just warm. The PCs and the heater on make it kind of warm in here. I did, yeah. Um, I did a lot of YouTube research on how to do like motion graphics and whatnot, and uh, <clears throat> excuse me, made them in After Effects. It's a really dead bug. Ah, I'm not a huge fan of fire fireball. The the cinnamon was just too much. Maybe? Why does he do that? Like, he's on the wall. And he just falls off of it if you go too high. What the heck? Like something weird. This is gonna sound strange, but I think it's the Astrium. The closer we get to the vault, the stronger it feels. <laughs> Careful, buddy. We still don't know how this thing works. Pocket dimension. I keep forgetting that's not the button. Oh, wow. I've never tried mixing those. That sounds really interesting. Here we go, BD. Why do all these planets have bottomless pits? I don't... That is a good question. Lots of seismic activity, I guess? achievement we face extinction dogma blinded us to the path of balance and gradually we allowed our pride to corrupt us so these are the zeppo the greater control we sought the further we fell into ruin okay i lead the remnants of my people into the great unknown Hoping that we will finally find peace. Did they just turn to ash? I shall teach them the ways of the Force. Master Custis. We shall begin with physical preparation. What is the Force? Gather round, everyone. 
Master Kestis. Do you think the Empire will find us? Shadowbolt, hello. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. The cube! I wonder if the holocron is a warning. And it's not what we thought it was. It's the Empire! Wait, am I at a top-down view? The Inquisitors have found us. They're coming! Master, shall we fight them? Surrender now, and we may spare the youngest. That's right. On your knees. so sad. Is it an alternate reality? Do we break BD? Bad 
feeling I'd see you here. Oh? How uncharacteristically prescient of you. Here I thought your greatest virtue was your dogged persistence as you stumbled from one debacle to the next. Guess you made a mistake not killing me on Brock, then. A scant mercy. I waged one meaningless Padawan against a prize that will win me the Emperor's favor. You think I'm gonna let you walk away with the holocron? Of course not. We both have our pride. But yours has cost you the lives of all the four sensitive children on that list, as well as your own. Like you said, Trilla, I'm persistent. If you all have not played this game, I'll give you a moment. Q, thank you so much for the rain. Oh, hi, Rain. Thank you so much for the shout out. Please make sure you guys go show Ayla some love. How is your stream, Stram? Thank you also for 22 wonderful months. Thank you. I hope you're doing well. Um, Yeah, spoiler alert for all of those coming in from Ayla's stream. We are at one of the more prominent fights in the game so if you're not wanting to see that i totally understand um but warning it's going pretty well we Bears. have been playing for Eats. like six hours today Battlestar galactica space hello welcome back for 30 months i hope you're doing well all right and a sub i know right you guys are great um so yeah forewarning if you guys are wanting to play this game on your own and not be spoiled um there's your warning This was their story. Oh no. No. Yeah, I don't like the ponchos either. Good night, Auden. Now 
they have the holocron. Yeah, I don't like the ponchos either. I usually take it off, but anytime you get a new one, it like puts it on you. An inquisitor is born. No! How do we get out of here? I thought because they were once aligned with the force the same way that the Jedi were, that they could still access it. Yeah, new poncho, you gotta wear it right now. What? No. <laughs> Oh man, they're here! Enemy contact. Get him, frog! Thank you for hanging out. I hope you have a lovely rest of your Friday. <laughs> no fashion game. Unplayable! It's not like uh, Dark Souls. Oh, we can actually go get this thing now. I think. I actually don't know. I know the lives of lots of little kids are at stake, but uh, we gotta go find some loot. He kind of looks like a pilot with this outfit. Kind of. It's fine. Like, why couldn't he grab onto that? He, he was literally at the ledge. Some of the things I just don't get in this game. They don't make sense. Come back. BD1 is really cute. I think he's my favorite droid. Or they're my favorite droid. Hit him. 
I feel like BD1 does a better job of BB8 though. Seer. I saw what happened between you and Trilla, what you both went through. I'm so sorry. I was arrogant, I was foolish. I could never understand what you went through. She has a holocron. I don't know where she's taking it. I'm responsible for the path that Trilla is on. And what she does next is the cost of all of my mistakes. Our mistakes are in the past. And it's all of our responsibility, and it's about what we do next that's important. You taught me that, Seer. You're right. I know where she's taking it. Where are we going? There's a fortress. Where they take Jedi. Where the Inquisitors come from. It's a place of torture. It's the place I escaped. I just never thought I'd be going back there. Won't be going alone. I'll have a friend with you. Let's do it, team. No. What? I'll have a Jedi with me. Aww. Neil. Are we are we being knighted? By the right of the Council, by the will of the Force, Cal Kestis. Rise, Jedi Knight. You are ready. So are you. Jedi, let's go. Imagine being a clumsy Jedi. I mean, they could grow back limbs, right? It's fine. Just be careful. You're making good progress, Cal. Thanks. Where do we go? The fortress. What's the fortress? There's some star fighters over here. Do we go here? Yeah? You Jedi love going from one problem to the next. Don't you ever get sick of it? It's the nature of Man's the mission, right here. Captain. You knew the risks when you accepted the charter. I know getting this hollow thingy and rebuilding the Jedi Order is important. But do you really think you'll be able to change things? We believe we can. Yes. We can put an end to oh. the oppression of the Empire. I just... Uh, I never met any Jedi. They were always off doing their thing, and we Lateros took care of our own. We never got help from Jedi. Sorry to hear that. Nothing is perfect. Eh, yeah, well, what are you gonna do? That's what my great-grandma always said. All right, we're here. Get in your chair. Oh, okay. Good night, Sage. Have a lovely night. <laughs> <laughs>